Hi, welcome back. And now it's time for us to take a gastronomic journey, you know, with Jennifer Sharifatu Mensa. She's the CEO of Chenis Health Living. And today she's going to be making a mint madness bowl. Hmm. Why is it called a mint madness bowl? Anyway, this is Breakfast Daily, and of course, you know we give you a bit of knowledge one bite at a time. Hi, so welcome to the show. Thank you. How Thanks are for you? Having me. I'm fine, thank you. <laughs> All right, mint madness. Yes. What is a mint madness bowl? Okay, so with mint madness bowl, we have um, banana, mm -hmm. pineapple, mm -hmm. um, mint in there, and we have our chocolate um, protein powder. All right. And we have soya milk in All there. All right. So what makes it the mint madness? The mint? Yes. And you have kill in it. Oh. So, yeah. Oh, there's a kill. There's kill in it. Yeah. So that means there's going to be a bit of bitterness. Not too much. Just a bit. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's okay, true. take us through. Take this off. So we have some frozen yes these are all even the kale. and the frozen kale yes everything this here. is frozen banana let me yes. guess right so basically would you serve this as a breakfast or as a dessert or what yeah, exactly? yeah you can have this it's a bowl so you can have mm -hmm. it as a breakfast if you want to okay so this is our fresh meat So this is the mint? Yes. Yeah. Looks fresh. Yes. <laughs> this is the soy milk. Soy milk. Yeah. So could you use any milk? I'm glad you're using <laughs> soy milk though, but can you use any milk? Yes, please. You can use any right. milk that you want to. Since everything is frozen already, um, yeah. that means we don't need to um, add put ice, ice to it. No, yeah. no so ice you can only no. add ice when it's not frozen. Yes. But what's the best way to do it? Would you say it's better to freeze the fruit? I prefer freezing the fruit. I don't okay. want to add anything else to right. it. So yeah, I just freeze it. So you just said chocolate protein powder. Can you use any other form of protein powder? Yes. So you can use the whey. Yes. The whey powder. You can use the vanilla. You can use any one that you want right. to use. I'm asking. Okay. So I'm basically asking for, especially for people that work out. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I think we are good. Okay. Okay. We have um, chocolate granola, granola here. Yeah. So. so for people who don't eat chocolate, what would you substitute that for? Okay, you can use the vanilla or just the plain one. Yeah, the plain granola. Yes, the okay. plain one. And also, you know, for people who don't eat chocolate, that means the cocoa powder will be a bit problematic. Yes. What can you use? You can also use the chocolate, um, I mean, the vanilla one. All right. Or you can use, we have different types. So this is chocolate chips. Yeah. yeah add a bit of this. We have cocoa. So that's what's on the screen, right? That's the chocolate granola and yeah. the chocolate chips. We have cocoa nips here. Okay. So this is very chocolatey since you have chocolate and cocoa. Yes. And, and the powder, of yeah. course. So this I heard, I heard um, Sir David talking a lot about cocoa, so I mm -hmm. had to, you know. Oh, okay. This week, yeah, it's yeah. about Ghana cocoa, so. Yes. <laughs> 
And we are glad that the cocoa farmers are going to be happy. Yes. Now. So we have agave here. Just now, for those who don't have any agave syrup, what mm. can they use? Okay. I'm, I'm asking all these questions because <laughs> there are people that don't have everything that we have here and probably yes. watching us and want to, you know, try. Okay. You can use um, honey. Honey. Yes. Okay. You can use honey. Honey is also good. So Jen is healthy living. Why is it important for you to make healthy foods? Okay, you need to. Um, everybody wants to live longer. Nobody wants to die right. before their time. Nobody wants to be falling sick here and there. Mm -hmm. So you have to make the right choices. What you eat, how you eat, the quantity, yeah. <laughs> the time you eat. Yeah. You just don't eat anyhow. So was there anything that actually led you to, you know, um, rather choose the healthy way of cooking? Um, was there any life-changing <laughs> moment? Oh, my, my godmother, actually. <laughs> Your godmother, what yeah. happened to her? Okay, so she's a bit old and she's always complaining that like one way food and mm -hmm. she's becoming too heavy so right. it's becoming hard for her to move about or to be active like the way she used, she used to. to be so i had to do something about it because right. the complaint was becoming too, too much. much so i decided to do this and she enjoys it very well. yeah very much okay, okay. so i think all right done. so thanks to your godmother <laughs> you know you now have a thriving business yes that is focused on you know keeping people alive and healthy yes well done so, thanks godmother this is how it looks Ooh. Mint madness smoothie bowl all right yeah all right obviously i can't be doing this alone it's time for me to invite quickly to join us and i'm sure quickly is going to be very excited <laughs> he's dancing his way here <laughs> although you can't see him everything that has trouble come yes. here <laughs> oh, yeah, you know. oh, oh, you're a chocolate person. Oh, you, you didn't know? Yeah. You're new. Uh, very new. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so when it comes to chocolate, yeah. which of the categories of chocolate do you like? Do you like brown, black, or white? I like all chocolates. Mm -hmm. I know that the darker the chocolate, the better the it better is, the healthier it is yeah. for you. But I love all chocolates. That's mm -hmm. me. I'm a just a chocolate person. Mm -hmm. So, mm. talk to me me about what you have here. I'm seeing this lovely bowl. Okay, so that's a mint madness mm -hmm. smoothie bowl. It has banana. Mint madness smoothie bowl. Smoothie bowl. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I can see some banana in here. Yes. And I see granola. Yes. I see chocolate nibs. Yes. I see pineapple. Yes. Is that about everything? Yes, that's yes. about everything. And then there's mint. Yes. There's mint in the banana. Yes, and there's yeah. kale in it as well. There's, there's kale. kale. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So there's a bit of tanginess in it. Yeah, but you know, this just talks to very me. Very healthy. About very healthy. Yeah. What do you what have you drizzled on here? The agave syrup. Yes, agave nectar. Ah. Yes. Hey. <laughs> Something must kill a man now. But nothing, this is not killing you because it's healthy food. <laughs> mm. How'd you like it? Mm. Mm. It's good, right? Yeah. This is the time of the day that we say, you know, we need time to enjoy. Yeah. So, please take a look at this from Voice Factory. Don't forget that Voice Factory the finale. Yes, it's this just, weekend. Yes, and we're okay. excited. So, a little something from the Voice Factory. True. Um, Sherry Fatu. Yes. Where can people follow you? Where can people find you? Okay, people so I'm on enjoy IG. Enjoy some of this goodness. <laughs> I'm on IG and Facebook at Shinny's Healthy Living. Yeah. Yeah, and you can find us at Sinyaniva, or you can call us on 54 66 Two eight seven six one. Mm. Yes, to make all your juices, smoothies, orders. We are open. Fantastic. 